Well, it is Friday, and that means we headed into another community for our weekly check in with the chief. This time we headed to Highland Park where interim chief James McMahon has been on the force as an officer for 16 years and interim chief since January. He believes positive change is working thanks to cooperation with the city council and the mayor's office. How have things changed in Highland Park in your years of being here? Well, uh, they change a lot actually. Over when we first started, we were we we're still doing handwritten reports. Um, we we didn't have a lot of equipment, and um, you know we weren't receiving a lot of training. Over the years, our officers are getting a uh, tremendous amount of training. It's available to them. We, we've had a lot of improvements. We we have uh, some of the best technology available to law enforcement um, in terms of body cams car cameras. We're on this beautiful block here on Eason and, and near Second, but we saw a lot of abandoned buildings. What's your, what's your major crime issue here in Highland Park? What do you worry about? We're dealing with domestic violence. We're dealing with um, individuals who are suffering from mental health um, crisis. And um, those are probably significant amount of our runs. We were fortunate enough to receive a grant to um, employ a couple social workers that will work hand in hand with our officers that should be uh, implemented here relatively soon. I think it'll help in, in terms of how we respond to individuals suffering from mental health crisis. And tell me about some bright spots here in Highland Park. I mean, you've gotta be proud after being on the force for 16 years and now you're the interim chief. We've got a lot of great citizens in Highland Park. And unfortunately, Highland Park gets a bad rap and people don't give them, I don't think Highland Park gets the credit that it deserves, to be honest with you. Um, it's not like some people make it out, like it's this violent city. Um, there's, there's a lot of great people here and a lot of good programs, a lot of youth programs. And I think uh, Highland Park's gonna be the place to be here in, within the next few years. You gotta hope so, right? Chief McMahon says he now has monthly meetings with residents and for the most part, he says the feedback has been quite positive. And if residents ask for change, they do their best to implement those requests as soon as possible but we drove around mm -hmm. a lot and i mean there's good things a lot of things going on for kids like that little homework house that you saw there yeah. and, and so improvements are being made that's right and everybody wants to be proud of where they live and hopefully he's right yes. maybe it will be the best place to be in a couple of years in a couple of years fingers, right. crossed, fingers crossed right yeah